Alright guys, today you're going to learn some basic calisthenic freestyle moves. Some of them are muscle up 360, jump over p-bar. Uh, it's for the beginners who want to start to do some freestyle. And now I'm getting on the train here. So, see you there. I want to clarify guys that these moves that I'm going to teach you guys today uh, these are how I learn them and I'm not an expert just uh, learn them with my team beast bars and uh, so I'm going to show the progress how step by step how you you can learn them uh, everybody can do them no matter what level because they are step by step so you can progress from level zero to one two three four five or whatever level you want to go to Okay, so now we are here. We're going to start with the muscle up 360. First, get a nice and good warm up so you don't hurt yourself. So, this is how it's going to look on the P bars here. Alright, so the muscle up 360 from the beginning, you're going to do on the parallel bar, uh, so you don't need to do that from the high. So we're going to start here. First of all, you need to learn how to spin, so we're going to do a 180 first. We're going to do the 180 first, then you're going to try to spin more and more and more, until you get to 360 and touch the bar again. Doing the muscle of 360, when you spin the one way, hold on to the if you spin to the left, hold on to your right a little bit more. So you hold if I spin left, I hold my right hand on the bar a little bit more when I spin until I get to this side, then I release. And uh, I try to always uh, I try to I try to look to the left more so I can see with my eyes earlier than my body so I can see where I'm grabbing or what I'm grabbing. First you spin at 180 then you spin a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more until you get to 360. You don't need to grab it just touch it. Alright like this. From the beginning it's hard to spin because you need to get your hip a little bit up so you have time to spin so don't just spin you need to get your hip up I'm going to show it now always keep your knees together then the spin will be much much easier If you're scared on doing a high bar, uh, try to use these. But anyway, that's uh, how I learned it and that's how you can learn it too. So let's go on to the next move. Now I'm going to teach you how to jump over the P-bar. From this one to this one. And this is how it looks. So start from one bar first. You jump from this to the other side here, without grabbing any other bar. When you do this, uh, think of uh, lifting your hip up so you can jump over. That's the most difficult part and that's going to make a big difference when you do this move. When you swing, bend your knees to your stomach and lift your hip up like this. The most difficult part is that it's a little bit scary from the beginning but when you do it right, you bend your knees, lift your hip you really 
apply like that and it's pretty easy after jumping from one bar to the outside of the bar now we're going to try to jump from inside to the inside from this to this just going to jump not grab because that's the first step so just jumping over and land on your feet If you're afraid of jumping over the bar, you can do this. So you can do it from the, the edge of the P bar, so you don't have the bar under you, for just to practice. It's time to do the move, jump over, grab the bar and stay there. One more thing can be that when you are jumping, switching with your grip, you hold it like this and then you want to jump, switch here and take the other bar here. So if you feel comfortable, you can jump from one to another and back and back and forth, back and forth. Okay, so this was everything for today. I hope you learned something. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel, like this video and comment below what you would like to learn next time. I will try to make a video of it. So, see you next time.